Construction on the new 260 US million Demerara River Bridge has been moving apace without any delays. The contractor, China Railway Construction Cooperation Limited, has been working day and night to meet the December 2024 deadline. On Thursday, the Minister of Public Works, Juan Agil, paid a visit to get an update from the contractor. The temporary bridge for the construction of the new four-lane high-span bridge has been completed. The contractors are currently installing platforms for the new river crossing. Minister Agil, along with the contractors, inspected one of the main towers connecting the western and eastern sides. Steel piles have already been installed on the western side. Where we are standing on here is where you will have the main tower that will link the 300 meter span from the western side to the eastern side. Each one of those towers will be supported by 38 piles. And those are the steel piles that you see formed there. Each one of those steel piles will take off about 500 cubic tons, meters, meters, cubic meters of concrete. And from the technical people's explanation to give the average Guyanese who uh, would like to know what that means, it's about 58 trucks of concrete. Concrete will be poured onto the 38 piles on Friday, marking a significant milestone. Despite shipping challenges via the Panama Canal for construction materials, the contractor was able to successfully use a longer route through Cape Verde. This bridge, apart from its transformational nature, is also tied into a time-bound, time-specific contract arrangement. And that means that we have to be able to meet significant milestones to ensure that we are keeping the progress going. Minister Agile also noted that the necessary arrangements with the Maritime Administration Department and river users have been completed to ensure safe transit while the construction is ongoing. As it is right now, with the concerns that we would have had and that we would have expressed to the Chinese contractor when we would have met before, the delays, they have been a significant movement in terms of making up of time. And one of the significant movements is that they are able now to work day and night. And that day and night work will continue. Uh, all the arrangements with the Maritime Administration and all the users of the Demerara River meetings have been held. They've been given all the clear guidance, safety measures that are required to ensure transit is safe, the work of the um, contract is not hindered, and that no one is injured while transiting. So our safety issues have been resolved. For now, the only concern is the steady supply chain of sand, aggregates, and other materials to keep up with the volume of works being done on the new bridge. Once completed, this new bridge will help to alleviate traffic congestion and also improve the lives of citizens. Reporting for the newsroom from the construction site of the new Demerara River Crossing, I am Isanella Patwo.